Now, another type of intelligence that you might have is intrapersonal. Intra means inside. So intrapersonal intelligence means you know yourself very well. You're comfortable in your own skin. And so if you have this intrapersonal intelligence, you're going to study better if you can understand why what you're studying matters to you. Um, how does this apply to your own self and to your own life? And if you can make some relevance between what you're studying and uh, yourself as a person, you're going to work better at it. You're going to be able to accomplish it more. Uh, sort of the opposite of that is the interpersonal intelligence. Inter means between. So interpersonal intelligence means you're good at relating to people. Uh, in kindergarten teacher speak, uh, this is the type of intelligence where the teacher says, plays well with others. So if you scored highly on the interpersonal scale, uh, what you're going to want to do is probably work together in groups of people, uh, study together as a group. If you're trying to study by yourself, you may just have trouble getting the energy up to even do much of anything. Whereas if you're working together with a group, maybe you're quizzing each other on the uh, homework or the, or the topics for an exam or things like that. So if you scored high on the interpersonal, uh, work on working together with other people. Then we have the naturalist. This does sort of get back into some of the more traditional intelligences we think of. Uh, the naturalist intelligence has to do with studying and understanding nature and science. It also involves things like categorizing things. If you like to sort things into categories and understand them that way, uh, that's a naturalist kind of thing as well. Um, typically, you're going to like the outdoors. Uh, so if you want to study, maybe you try studying outdoors. Or if you can't be outdoors, at least be near a window where you can watch outdoors. Uh, so that, uh, because if you get shut up in, a, in an isolated little room, uh, again, that sort of stalls you or whatever. So the naturalist is looking at understanding the natural world and science. Then finally, we have the existential. The existential intelligence is sort of the philosophical big picture. We're looking at bigger meanings, religious kinds of things, uh, looking at life, the universe, and everything. Uh, so when you're doing uh, schoolwork or studying or working, uh, you're going to want to see how does this fit into the big picture? How does this fit into the universe? So, uh, so you're going to want to look and see, how does this apply? How do things, your topics apply in the greater universe? And so these are some different types of intelligence. And there's a website that can be very useful um, in terms of if you want to go and explore more about the multiple intelligences. Um, and it's um, HTTP colon slash slash surf aquarium. dot com slash m i so that's a website where uh, we have the intelligences there's an area on there where you can uh, take a quiz to find out what your intelligences are um, there are detailed descriptions of each of the different kinds of intelligences. So you can look and see uh, that particular section of the site is aimed at teachers. Uh, but you can learn a lot by looking at the recommendations for teachers. You can learn a lot about planning your own studying and your own uh, work time and space. Uh, this website also ha has a bunch of fun activities. Again, as I said, things are aimed at teachers. 
Uh, this section actually is a bunch of activities that have been selected uh, for kids with various intelligences. Uh, but sometimes it's nice to take a study break and do something relatively mindless. Uh, and so uh, you might have fun playing a couple of those games uh, just as a relaxation between some of the book learning, especially if you're a bodily kinesthetic uh, sort of person or a naturalist, uh, where you do need to take a break from the uh, studying for a while. Um, but anyhow, this is a really good website with a lot of useful material on it for you to look at.